Google Classroom's originality reports function as a tool to correct unsighted content and potential plagiarism. When you create an assignment, be sure to check the originality reports box. This allows for reports to be run throughout the duration of the assignment. Before they return their assignments, students can run up to three reports. This first example shows a student sample where the student copied and pasted without using the tool. You can click on the passage to go to the site with the original content. You can also toggle back and forth between the number of flag passages and the percent of the entire paper or assignment. Let's go to the next student where we can see they're currently working on the assignment. Switching to the student view, you see they have the option to run their originality report before they hand in the assignment. Once the originality report is finished, the view link will open the report where any issues are highlighted. In this instance, the student is missing a citation. The report shows the context of the flagged content. The student can go back to their work to resolve the issue before turning in their assignment. One way they can cite sources is using the Explore tool. This allows students to insert footnotes in various citation formats. They simply click the button and Explore finds connections between the documents, topics, and online content. Clicking the quotation mark symbol next to the appropriate resource cites the passage in the chosen format. Switching back to the teacher view, you can run an originality report even if the student hasn't returned the assignment yet. We hope to see that there is no flagged content, but this does not guarantee a plagiarism-free paper. You can also provide feedback, of course, before the student has completed the assignment. Once they have turned it in, you can return it to them with a grade if applicable.